What is up guys? I am back, finally. Sorry about the wait, my computer has been having some moments lately. So, yeah. But I apologize for the quality of this video because I'm still not able to do everything because of all the problems, but I am a I'm able to do this because I mean this doesn't really involve the internet. Do it like recording this, like this me talking. So, um, but, hang on a minute, oh, go away, go away, go away, no. right, no, um, right, what I am going to be talking about is, what is wrong with Halo Reach, because I was watching, I can't remember what, I think it was, um, I don't know, I can't remember what it was. It was something to do with Halo 4 or something. And the guy said something about being better than Reach or something. I don't know. I don't understand what everyone's problem is with Halo Reach. I mean, it was the first Halo game where you could properly customise your armour. I mean, I know you could customise your armour in Halo 3, but you can't. Re you, did, you couldn't really do a lot. So... I mean, how many things do you get if it, what was that, like 10, 8 maybe, I don't know, you can't really get a lot, but Reach, you can get loads of things, you can get loads of helmets, loads of shoulders, chest, knees, wrists, you couldn't get wrist things in, you couldn't even get knees in Halo 3, so, I mean, yeah, you could get knees, obviously, but you couldn't change the knees on the armor so um yeah i mean that's one thing that personally i think is better than halo 3 i mean the campaign for reach yes it's not going to involve halo it's not going to involve the ring because it's what happened before the ring so obviously you're not going to go on Halo, are you? Because you haven't discovered it. At the moment, you're just Marines and Spartans fighting the Covenant. That's all you're doing. You haven't. You, you don't even know of the Monitor. You don't know the Rings. You don't know the Flood. I mean, I mean, there was a path in Reach that I thought. It was the flood. I think it was the the part when you're flying around in a falcon around the city and taking down Covenant jammers. It's the one where you go into the hospital. No, not the hospital. The um the one with the green symbol. And the hospital's got a blue cross thing. The sort of disco nightclub thing, you've got a ready orange one. It's it's the one with um the green sort of symbol thing. Yeah, it's that. I seriously thought that was the flood. But it wasn't, it was just the buggers. So, yeah. Um what else? Um Right, what have we done? We've done armour. The actual Halo. Uh, I don't know. So instead, instead of me talking, I'm sure most of you are fans of Arbiter Six One Seven. I'm going to show some of his comments. No, not his comments. Well, yeah, some of his comments that he did for the We Say Our Goodbyes Halo Reach video. And because some of them I disagree with. So, I mean, sorry about the quality because I can't just record the audio from the computer and then put it into this video. I've got to actually have the YouTube video on my iPad and then put the iPad near the microphone. So I apologise for the quality.
just say that is me moving the mic because it's terrible. I have no idea how loud this is going to be. I'm just going out the volume on this thing. Right, this is now with a six one seven. We say goodbye video with Halo Reach comments. Um, I'd like to say goodbye to Reach. You were the best one making a shit of us, except Halo 3 was a lot better. But, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll come back to you every now and then. I'll never forget the good moments I had on Reach. Before, I don't remember Reach. Okay, oh, where do I even begin? Reach? Reach, you were the black sheep of the Halo line. I have always oh. had a little bit oh. mixed feelings about you, but you know what? It was an important era. I've evolved so much while I was playing Reach and working on the machinimas in it, and it's been fun, and as much as I didn't like you as much as I loved Halo 3, it was an important era that I couldn't have gone without to Reach. Goodbye. I will miss Dully and Halo 4. Uh, Halo Reach, you had your good times, you had your bad times, a lot more bad times, unfortunately. But, but yeah, so, goodbye. Halo Reach and the stupid retarded Halo Reach clients that inhabited them. You all started. <laughs> Halo Reach was my first real uh, Halo game I played, and I really enjoyed it. And if you want to see what's in the future, I really just miss Halo Reach. So goodbye, Reach. Alright, so I was skinning this cat the other day, and like. <laughs> I was, I, I kept having to stop because, uh, my teeth, they kept getting, like, full of hair and shit, and it, it just really pissed me off, you know? Anyways, on the Halo Reach. Um, well, where do I begin with this, this, this game? Um, yep, that's about rounds it up. Alright, who's next? Okay, I love Fixer because he told me about them green streams, and I think a lot of great shit was in Halo Reach, so... Yeah, I hate the speakers in my making, so... What can I say about Halo Reach? For this reason, it's so much like the world since. It also taught me a lot to love my gear and share my gear. It's so weird. We can buy Halo Reach. I don't even know what you're saying. Okay, well, my. Oh, God. Well, it's decided to have a moment. Oh. Oh, hang on a minute, guys. Right, where's the bit that I actually want? Hang on a minute, guys. Let me just try and find this. Right, I think I've sorted it out. So, this is going to be something from Robo Leader or Sev from Ross. And then it's going to be Arbiter 6 and 7.
Uh, I got a lot of projects to finish up, like Rise of the Spartans, a whole bunch of feature ads, the director's cut. Um, I'm only planning about one or two machinimas in Halo 4, so the rest of my machinimas are going to be either Halo 3, Halo Reach, or even a combination of all, all the Halo games. I'm going to try to do one that kind of spans over many. Um, I, I really like Halo Reach. Everyone seems to hate it and think it's terrible, but I, I disagree. I thought it was a great game. I believe it's the best game overall, if you take everything to consider. Uh, I thought Halo 2 was the best campaign. Halo 3, best custom games, and maybe even matchmaking. Um, but Halo, Halo, Halo Reach had great Forge. It brought us Forge World. Um, it was great for Machinima. I wish we could lower the weapons over Xbox Live, but still, it was, it was an overall great game. And I, you know, if I think about how many hours I spent on this game, do I, do I think it's worth it? Yes, it was definitely worth it. This game was made perfectly. And, uh, so, no, I'm not saying goodbye, because I'll, I'll probably be playing Reach a lot, except for matchmaking, because it was pretty bad, especially big team. Like the DMR the sniper that take out vehicles, it's like, pew pew, and the vehicle blows up, and it's like, whoa, whoa, I mean, you can't blow me up, I, you're, you got a little pistol, and you're shooting my car, oh, I'm gonna blow up your car, because I'm a really overpowered pistol, and they're like, oh, let's make the pistol overpowered, because that's cool, and people like that, and they're like, no, let's make the DMR overpowered, because that's cool too, and then they're like, oh, your car's gonna blow up, okay, I'm just gonna go jump in this class now. <laughs> Yeah, basically. I'm not liking it just because he is. I actually do think Halo Reach was a really good game. I actually do. I do think that. Because, I mean, <clears throat> it's the first, I mean, I loved Halo t When I, I first started playing Halo from Combat Evolved. I started playing it from when it started. And if you think about how it's been going for 13 years 13 years nearly 14 years 14 years we've been playing Rick we've been playing Halo if you've been playing it right from the start 14 years nearly can you believe that but yeah I I mean combat evolved was just amazing when I first played I didn't I didn't even know Halo existed until I started playing it I played it once and I was just amazed by it. And um, my brother, because I think about five days, five days later, I was, I started it again for about the sixth time probably. And my brother came in saying, "Look, you got other games. You got to play something else." And I said, "No, this is amazing. This game is awesome. Leave me alone." Um, but yeah, when I then got after all that, I then got Halo Two. I'm doing all that, and like, oh my god, this is amazing, he's going through space on a bomb. When I realised you were playing as an elite, I thought, I was like, oh great, you're playing as the enemy. Fantastic, we're going to have to kill the Master Chief. But, when I finished Halo 2, I was like, the Arbiter is a beast. He is amazing, and it's just his... His voice is so cool. It actually is. I want a voice like that. But yeah, so after that, I had to get Halo 3. And to all Halo fans out there, Halo 3 is when my brother stopped playing it. He finished Halo 3 and was and just gave up on it. I don't know why. He just gave up on it. He might have hit an age that he just decided, nah, I'm too old for this now. Mate. I'm 17 still. I'm nearly 18 and I'm still playing it and I still love it. So, I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of you that's older out there. Much older than, than 18. So, I mean, yeah, I don't even know what to say. Um, yeah, so, yeah, done Halo 3. Amazing ending. I love the whole trying to escape from an exploding halo kind of reminds me of the ending of Halo Combat Evolved where you're trying to escape 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 from a exploding ship kind of the same thing um, I mean if you think there's a lot of things that are actually no I think there's only two things that are similar with Combat Evolved and 3 the ending escape, escape from an exploding thing and the um, 
activation room for Halo and the index and all that. Them two are them. Them two are the same. If you think of anything, if you know if there's, if there's anything else that similar, leave it in the comments. I'm not sure there is, but um, uh, yeah. Then hey, obviously Halo Reach came out, and it was like this is amazing. You can have your own. Uh, you can have your own armor. That's pretty cool. So, I mean, we'll probably, okay then. So we're just, we're just gonna be playing as the Master Chief before he becomes the Master Chief. Okay then. Right. So right, I'll create my armor. Create my armor for like custom games, multiplayer. You know, not myself a beast. You know. All that. I mean, you can't really do a lot at the beginning because you only got default stuff. Yeah, right. Start the game. Beginning cutscene. See the helmet? Wait. Wait, that's my helmet. That's my helmet, that is. And then, obviously, it's not. You know. You're not playing as the Master Chief, you're playing as your own character. So, that's, I mean, that's pretty cool. Um, Halo 4, when that came out, I mean, the graphics were amazing, or are, they still are. Not really, um, video. And they're not really compared to, five, no, not 5, um, Halo 2 anniversary, but obviously that that's come out later. No, that's a n that's a newer game, so obviously the graphics are going to be better. But um, yeah, I mean, I mean, um, it's it's sad that they took out the elite. I mean, I'm pretty sure the elite would have been pretty cool in Halo 4, and there would have been a lot of help for people doing machinimas, but you know. I mean that was three, three four three. It was their first time doing a game, so I mean they learned. They brought back the ability to play as an elite in Halo Two Anniversary. So I mean I thank them for that. I mean I can't even I can't play Two Anniversary, but because I ain't got an Xbox One. But oh well, doesn't matter. Um, uh, what else? What else is there? Um, I can't really think of anything. Uh, anyway, yeah, I apologise for the terrible quality of the video because, of course, computer problems. So, um, yeah, that was that. I mean, yeah, that's basically. I veered off from Halo Reach a bit, but, you know, I mean, what I thought was Reach, I, ba I basically said, so, I mean, I don't really see any problem with Reach, everyone seems to hate it, I don't know why, because, I don't know, because it's, it's not Halo 3, you don't play as a Master Chief, you can't be the Arbiter, I don't know, stuff like that, probably, Sim simple things like that make things, people dislike it, and I don't know why, I mean, don't think I, I don't even know. Basically, it's a good game. Stop whining. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, if you got anything you, you thought of Halo, if you thought Halo Reach was good, then leave it in the comments. And I don't know, I might do a video with a bit about people who think Halo Reach was good. So yeah, but. Yeah, I don't really know what else to say. So, I'm just going to leave it with... Peace!